Hello friends, welcome to ADO.NET tutorial. In this video, we will see how to get the column information which was missed in the previous video. So, we can use the missing schema action property to pull other information. In the last video, we saw only the column names and its data type is valid. We retrieved the column information right by iterating through the data column collection. So, we saw column name and its data type. Only those two informations are valid and the other informations are not right. All other column information is not retrieved from the database and we saw that we can solve this by setting the missing schema action property and we should set the enumeration constant add with key. So if we do these two, I mean if we add this uh, missing schema action property, the missing schema action property will uh, give you the uh, other informations like uh, allow db null and uh, default. So those information becomes valid once you use this uh, property. So below is the code change required. We already have this code and we should add adapter dot missing schema action. So from adapter we are accessing this property and we are setting the add with the key. Right? That's the value we are setting to this uh, missing schema action property. Once you do that, we can get all the information needed. Now let's go to the demo. So if you see, we already have the adapter, right? Adapter is created on this uh, specific location. Now we will state that adapter dot missing schema action and missing schema action enumeration. And from there we will pick uh, add with a key. So now if you run the sample, You can see now the allow null is displaying properly, right? Category ID, it will not allow null. By looking at the schema here, we can say that category ID and category name both does not allow null. And you can see that, right? But a description and the picture allows null and you can see that a description Right, hello null is ticked here. That means these two we can leave empty. Right now, let's look at auto increment column. We know that ID is a auto increment column and that is displayed properly. Also, since this is a primary key, the unique property also set properly. So, with that one single property, we retrieved other information. Uh, from the adapter right by default adapter is giving column name as well as its data type by setting the missing schema action as add with the key we can retrieve other informations that's all here in this video thank you for watching bye